a medical assistant died when the ambulance he was in collided with a trailer at KM 77 of Jalan Johor Bahru Air Hitam near Machap here. Kluang OCPD Assistant Commissioner Lo Hang Seng said the victim, Idil Hamidun, 27, died at the scene. He added that the ambulance was heading towards Simpang Ringam to Machap when the incident occurred at around 8.20 p.m. on Tuesday. The ambulance had responded to another road accident earlier near SK Shri Machap and was taking two sisters and their guardian to a hospital for treatment. The ambulance hit the left back tire of the trailer, which was turning right to enter a workshop in Simpang Ringam, and spun out of control, he said on Wednesday. ACP Lowe added that the ambulance driver, Othman Gavan, 50, Nurse Yahira Halen, 24, Nurshada Halen, 18, and their guardian Sukiman Hassan, 59, sustained injuries while the trailer driver was unharmed. He added that all four were taken to Inchebasar Haja Kalsam Hospital in Kluang for treatment. The case is being investigated under Section 41 of the Road Transport Act 1987. In an unrelated case, police arrested a 34-year-old man who drove against traffic at a roundabout near Kota Iskander. Iskander Puteri OCPD Assistant Commissioner Julkeri Mukhtar said police received a video on Monday at around 3.30 p.m., which shows a silver-colored car being driven the wrong way at the Medini roundabout. Police were able to recover the vehicle's owner phone number and asked the person to come to the Jelling Pata police station to have his statement recorded. Initial investigations found that the driver was the vehicle owner's cousin and we asked the suspect to come to the police station immediately, he added. The suspect admitted that he was confused at the roundabout, he said adding that the suspect was arrested at around 5 p.m. on Tuesday. He also said that the vehicle had been seized and a urine test carried out on the suspect, who tested negative. Police have also issued a summons to the vehicle owner for allowing his car to be driven by an unlicensed driver, he said, adding that the case was being investigated under Section 42 of the Road Transport Act 1987.